Hello friends, welcome to Electromium. Today's video is about building simple LED flasher circuit on breadboard. These are the components which I will be using to do this experiment. We need a breadboard. I'm using three capacitors with three different values to determine the LED flashing rate. One of them is 220 microfarad, another one is 100, and the last one is 47 microfarad. I'm going to use one kilo ohm resistor to limit the current and DC547 transistor. For powering the circuit, I'm going to use 12 volts power supply. Let's go ahead and let's build the circuit. Here is my transistor DC547. I'll be connected to the breadboard. One kilo ohm resistor, one of the leads goes to the emitter of the transistor and the other one to the positive rail of the breadboard. So let's go for 100 microfarad for the first try. I will connect my capacitor. The anode will be connected to the emitter of the transistor and the cathode to the negative rail of the breadboard. I will connect my anode of the LED to the collector of the transistor and the cathode to the negative rail of the breadboard. Last thing we need to do is to connect our power supply to the circuit. I have 12 volts coming in through the circuit. I've changed the orientation of the circuit and brought the components to the left side of the breadboard so that you guys can get a better view on camera. So as you can see the LED flashes and this is the how the circuit works. So basically the flashing rate in such circuits is determined by the charging and discharging of the capacitor. A larger capacitance, larger capacitance value takes more time to charge and discharge, resulting in larger intervals between flashes, which means a slower flashing rate. It means if I remove the 100 microfarad capacitor, and replace it with a higher capacitor, 220 microfarad, the LED flashing rate would be slower. As you see, the LED flashes much slower than before. So what would happen if I do the opposite? I use a lower capacitance. Let's see, I will I remove the 220 microfarad and replace it with 47 microfarad which has the least capacitance value in our experiment so guess what would happen as you see LED flashes much faster than before and this is how the LED flashing circuit works I hope you enjoyed the video please leave a comment if you have any inquiries about the circuit and subscribe my channel thanks and have a good day